from New York. Ebro in the morning on Hot 97. Real quick, we, we let's get into something serious. The most important pressing issue of the day. Okay. Jay Z and Kanye. West. <laughs> Facts. Facts. Don't get distracted by Rob Kardashian and Black China, aka the Kardashians. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. I hate well, to say it. Well, no, I'm sorry, but this is the trashiest story ever. Let's just keep it. Somebody calls them the Kardashians because it's just like a, Com- a car wreck at all times. Yeah. Um, but this actually, the, the Rob Kardashian Black China story fits in to the Jay Z Kanye story mm-hmm. because Jay Z, I think the relationship fell apart. When he when Kanye decided to join the Kardashians, facts, and look at what happened yesterday. That's mm-hmm. ultimately the family you're choosing to be a part of. Right. And I I was super annoyed and um when when Kanye had that line on the album about Life of Pablo about B- Black China helped Rob take off the weight. I'm like I don't want to hear about. I remember viscerally reacting as a fan because I love Kanye's music of like. Please don't drag them into hip hop. Please, like I don't need it. Like I, we just don't need it. Yeah, I remember. And I think that part of the reason Hove can't mess with Ye is because of stuff like yesterday. Like right. it, because ultimately Beyonce is like the classiest woman in the world. You know, she worked herself, her family busted their ass from like lower middle class Houston mm-hmm. to being just incredible now you have beyonce who's queen of the world Mm -hmm. you have solange who's just this utterly respected amazing artist progressive Mm -hmm. phenomenal mom artist lady and then and then hove whose story is unbelievable as well and 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 then kanye who's one of Hove's good friends marries a woman who started at the top and basically stayed there by having a sex tape come out. Now, I'm not judging her for that. I'm not saying any nasty words about Kim as a result of having sex on camera. I'm just saying, let's just keep it real about how it all happened. And I think that this situation between Kanye and Jay is as simple as something all of us have experienced in our lives. You have a friend who you can no longer really mess with because your partner hates their partner. Mm-hmm. It's happened. It happens so many times. It happens within families. Like sometimes you just don't like the wife or the husband. It's just you rather just not be around them because you know that if you invite one, you have to get the other, and you don't necessarily want to be in that person's and, and, space. And, and maybe Hove can like, you know, maybe Hove's fine with Kim Kardashian. But you try to tell me there's no chance Beyonce is just like I'm not hanging out with the Kardashians. Like I'm just not. And and then let's let's play along. By the way, I realize we're all playing along with these stupid narratives that could be made up. But hey, that's what we're here for. Right. So let's play along even further. If Hove's story about him and Beyonce's marital troubles is real, everyone knows that if you were, if you're in the doghouse the way Hove was with Beyonce at some point, when you get out of that doghouse. You have to do whatever she wants to do for a long time. Right. So he gets out of the doghouse. You think now's the time when he's like, hey, babe, so I know you're really unhappy with me, and I had that menage a trois or whatever. <laughs> I'm sorry about that, but um, do you think we can hang out with Kanye and Kim? Should we invite them over? And, and Beyonce's like, hell no, we're not hanging out with them. <laughs> Shut up. Go back to your man cave. <laughs> so he he might not be in a position to be like right. make any demands. Right, right, right. But this is not the only time this happens. One eight hundred two two three nine seven nine seven. What is that relationship that basically fell apart for you simply because your partner and your friend's partner were just nah? <laughs> so we're taking your phone calls right now. One eight hundred two two three nine seven nine seven. Do you have a friendship you can no longer really keep because your partner hates your friend's partner? Because at the core of Jay-Z Kanye, I think it may really be about what Beyonce thinks about Kim Kardashian. And this happens all the time. So who's on the line? Uh, let's go to Holly. Holly. Ho- uh, Holly, yeah. Holly uh, your boyfriend's friend was dating a psychotic girl? Yeah, it was my boyfriend's friend. He was like, this guy is super sweet. Like, hands down, one of the nicest guy I ever met. And his girl that he was dating at the time was straight up psychotic, obsessive, like no one could see him. Like he was all hers. So what do you mean? Would you guys go on double dates? Or you couldn't even see him at all? We would try to do like um, events. All of our friends would try to get together and she would just like be so involved with him. And then anytime anyone would talk to him, she'd give like this like snarl, like, 
dirty glare. Snarl. It's like making everybody feel mad and uncomfortable to the point like they stopped, you know, trying to do girls thing together. Like the girls were no longer allowed to hang with them anytime they tried to do something. Oh gosh. Um, thank you for your call very much. Let's do one more. Howie from Jersey. Howie, what's the you're saying the wives have messed up the group of friends. Yeah, no, nah, it's Highway 30, not Howie. <laughs> Highway. highway? Oh, sorry. I'm sorry, Howie. I'm sorry, Highway. I, I, for some yeah, reason, I thought your name was Howie. All right, so highway. Hi highway 30. Uh, what happens? <laughs> what What happened with the group of friends' wives? Nah, all my friends can. not None of us take our wives out nowhere because none of them got the same personality where they would hang out with each other. And then on top, on the flip side, if I go out with my friends, my girl know how much of a whore my friends are. Right. So even if they're not being that, it's just in her head, like, what are y'all doing? Where are y'all going? So it, it just never works. So I'm always just with my wife. Oh, because uh. you can't hang out with the friends and you can't hang out without the friends. I don't friends. care about that. I, but a real, a real friend to come holler at me. I don't care about just being with my wife. Whatever. A real friend to come holler at me if you want to see me. Come I mean, with me and my wife. So you're saying you, you, you could, your wife would be cool if your friends want to come by the house, hang out, do a little something at the house. Oh yeah, yeah, that's cool. Yeah, but going out, nah. I don't but know now, now, but what if, what if you wanted to invite a few of your friends over and their wives though? That's too much because the wives you don't think could really play nicely. Now, see, my girl would be cool with it, but the wives would just sit there all quiet because nobody, not that they wouldn't get along, but they don't have the same kind of personality. They don't carry themselves the same way. Hmm. In so other words, in other words, quiet. Whose, wife, whose wife in the group is the hood rat chick? Is the hood rat? Yeah. Well, ain't none of us got no hood rat, but I can say mine is the most thorough. She ain't no hood rat. <laughs> <laughs> she'll, put some, she'll put somebody in the place real quick, right? Yeah, real quick. <laughs> and that, and that, I think that my friends' wives wouldn't be feeling like. Oh, so, so you're saying that they're they're a little soft, a little, and your and your girls just she's exactly. a real one. She's a real just one. The wives, not my friends, just the wives. Got it. Wow. Clap, clap, clap.